Hi Willie, this is a quick recording, uh, as I promised, just showing you how to uh, edit a photograph with the, the live mode turned on. This is an example of a live photo, it's my dad with the wee pop there uh, a few weeks back. If I hold my finger on the photo, as you know, you get the wee <laughs> video two seconds before, two seconds after. But the actual photograph itself, uh, it's a bit, uh, you know, the wee pop's looking away from me, uh, from the camera, so maybe you want to have her looking at you. So how do you do that? So, um, what you can do is uh, you can click edit at the top right of the photograph itself, okay? The photograph, uh, as long as it's fully downloaded uh, on your phone, and you might have to wait a second or two for that to, to happen, but once it's downloaded, you've got a button towards the bottom, right beside the cancel at the bottom left. The button looks like three or four concentric circles. So what you do is just tap that button beside the cancel, and it puts you into the, the, the live edit mode, okay? You'll see here what it's done. Uh, there's a wee yellow dot beneath that thing, saying you're in edit mode, but also it's letting you see there's a, a slider now. That's that slider that I was telling you about uh, on the phone earlier. The slider, what that lets you do is go back in time through the photo or through the video, the wee five second video, as you can see. So if I move the slider forward in time here by dragging it to the right, what you'll see is, ah, perfect. There's a much better photograph, right? So there's the wee pop looking at you. So what you do then is let your finger off the slider, okay? And you can see there a new button has appeared called Make Key Photo. So all you do is tap on Make Key Photo and it uses this photograph within the wee five second video as the main photograph itself. And that should synchronize across your, your iPad as well, Willie. When you're finished, click on Done. And what that will do is just save the update to the photograph itself. And hey presto, there you go. That's a much better photograph now than was there originally where the wee pop was looking away from the camera. Now, this version of the photograph, the wee pop's looking at the camera. And of course, if you do want to change it uh, at some point in the future, you're no problem. Just go back in, edit the photo, click those uh, dots or the circle button at the bottom of the screen. And again, use your slider to choose which uh, uh, frame is your perfect frame. Okay, so that's it, Willie. Hopefully that all makes, uh, makes sense. Uh, but uh, any problems, uh, sure, just uh, just give me a shout. All right, bye-bye.